hello guys hello to everyone uh, today in this video I will show you uh, how to add a new option in existing selection field in Odoo and for this purpose I'm using Odoo 16 as you can see this is Odoo 16 community edition and for IDE I'm using as usual uh, Visual Studio and uh, my custom module for this uh, today's practice is same uh, customization so let's just show you the scenario that what we are going to do today so let me just open contacts mm, let me just open any contact here and if you i just need to choose any selection field this is the selection field let's activate debugger mode sorry it is on and if you see here if i click add in contacts and addresses so this is a selection field here so if you can see this is a selection field and selection field technical name is type it has got five selections one is contact one is invoice address, third is delivery address, fourth one is private address, and fifth one is other address. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. So what we want here, I just want to create a sixth selection field, uh, selection for this selection field. And let's suppose we want a staff for this purpose. So how we can achieve that? Uh, I just want to tell you that this is already existing field um, which is on rest.partner. You can see this is a model. Model is equal to rest.partner. And we want to change. This field is present on rest.partner in context on addresses page. And this is the field. Okay. So what we need to do for this purpose, we need to go in our custom module. So I just need to create a new file because I don't have a, a REST partner um, inherit, inheritance at the moment. So I would say REST underscore partner extension or any name you want, dot .py file. Okay, um, once you create a new Python file, you just need to add it in your init file. So I would say import and that is REST underscore partner underscore extension just the abbreviation for extension ext okay uh, let me just copy from here from any inheritance file any of these basic lines okay so let me just paste them here so this is for as you know this is for the um, uh, importing models and fields for uh, creating a new uh, model or inheriting a model so here we are inheriting it let's me just change the class name here i would say res partner extension or any name you want uh, we are inheriting res dot partner as i have shown you in your um in front end um, we don't need this field we just need to add another okay already field name is uh, present and name is type so we, we say the same name field is equal to fields uh, dot uh, selection that is a selection field and this is what you need to add you need to say selection underscore add is equal to and you need to create a new a selection which i would say staff <clears throat> And string fill be sorry staff that's it sorry this is mistake okay so this is the right syntax I guess now okay so you, you just need to add this um, syntax so this field name already which is present that is type that is a selection field and you are adding another selection and that is staff okay let's restart our odoo service and upgrade our module so i would go in applications
let's upgrade. <coughs> So it's upgrading. Okay, it has been upgraded and no errors. That's good. Let's go back to our contacts. Just click anyone. Okay, here we just need to, uh, this is the page name where we have added another selection. So if you click here, this is a selection field before there were one, two, three, five and we have added the sixth one. If you scroll the cursor, mouse cursor here on this field, you will see one, two, three, four, five, six selection options in this field. Okay, brilliant. So this is how we can add another selection in our already existing selection field in Odoo 16 or Odoo 15 or uh, Odoo 14 as well. I guess this syntax will work. So, but this is for the most recent Odoo 16. Uh, I hope you like this video. If you like it, please like it, uh, subscribe it and share it with your friends. Thank you guys. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.